Hey there, welcome to module two. As we get started with this module, let's take a moment to just take a breath and look back at where we've been. We have truly enjoyed getting to know you and we'd like to extend a big warm thank you for sharing so much of yourselves with us this first week. We know from your one word answers about how you're feeling about the class, folks are excited. We have folks who are curious. We also have folks who are tired and folks who are a little nervous. So we want to make space for all of that. That's all of our humanity and um, lean in together and support one another through this journey. Also in module one, um, we engaged in a conversation about memorable educators and that was awesome. Um, as I look back at some of the things that you shared and pro tip, I've got a little sticky note here that I'm looking at, but I have some notes on. Uh, some of the words that came up were, uh, your memorable educators made you feel inspired. They were life-changing. They were motivating. And the theme, they did things that they didn't have to do. And that I find really fascinating because the research links that with kindness. People perceive, when, when people do things that they don't have to do, other people perceive those things as acts of kindness. I want you to keep that in mind because this word kindness is gonna keep coming up in this class. And all of those things are feelings. So we're seeing how that connects with um, the topic of our class humanizing, right? We've gotta feel good about what we're doing to have that self-confidence to lean in and to challenge ourselves and that's um, even harder for folks who are entering in from the margins and not in a dominant position when it comes to our social interactions. Let's see, what else? Uh, you did your course card and your homepage. You're gonna continue to build those kindness cues as we head into module two. And in module two, a couple of the things we'll be focusing on is uh, supporting multicultural students. So we'll be thinking about intercultural communication and you'll be doing some reflections on the um, cultural cues in your own teaching. So building some cultural awareness, again, which might be new to some of you and might not be new to some of you. Um, and then what we're gonna do is also be thinking more critically about building trust. We're gonna unpack what trust is and how it gets developed. And for our purposes, be thinking about how to develop it asynchronously online, although all of these practices can be applied to any course, right? I'm sure you're already thinking that. This is just good teaching. So to do that, you're gonna create the first draft of your own liquid syllabus using Google Sites. Okay, so take a deep breath. You've got this. You're gonna slow roll this. You're gonna do several drafts of your liquid syllabus in this course. So this week you do your first draft. You're also going to demonstrate your ability to create a video and host it and caption it. Nothing major. We're just looking for a real quick video clip. So you're going to be basically getting your arms around the foundations of creating videos this week. So again, one step at a time, lean in, take a deep breath. We're with you. You've got this.